Hello, hello to and welcome to day two. Um, in case you have never watched a video of me, mine, um, I'm Simone. I'm a Swiss scientist living in Canada. Um, and yeah, so, okay, it's day two. But before we go to day two, I wanted to show you the um, day one uh, swatch because now you can really see that greenish shimmer kind of developed that I actually didn't see in my video where I was swatching it first because it was kind of hard to see that chameleon look with the golden and the green shimmer so it's really cool so that's why this is here and I wanted to show you but let's find day two so day two is right here let's open it up oh okay cashmere rose let's get this out of the way Cashmere Rose, it says it's a standard, so no shimmer, nothing, which is perfectly fine with me. I actually do quite like shimmerings. I have had some really good luck, and recently I think it's just kind of like provided some nice little sparkle in my life. So Cashmere Rose. So let's start the way we did that yesterday, and let's hope that's going to work, um, with doing like a little... Um, oh yeah, look at that, now you can see that shimmer, sorry, distracted. A little um, ink splat here um, with this kind of cool method that I had learned from Karina Loves to Plan's video. And so I quite like doing it to give like a first impression of the color. So I'm taking my little plastic syringe, whoops, and I'm just going to put some droplets on here. I, I'm still learning how to do this best, so we'll see. We might develop this over the ink vent time. I'm taking a Ziploc bag, and apparently it works better if you use like a well-used bag. This one isn't so well-used yet, and I'm kind of trying to just splash it around. So, well, this looks like a little messy. So be it. So be it. It's all good. Okay, this looks like it. I know why it looks messy, but it kind of like looks like wine color. It's almost like I spilled some wine. I actually have, haven't been drinking wine in a long time, but that's kind of like what it looks like to me. It is kind of a nice dusty pinkish thing though, which is not my favorite to be honest, but let's see how it behaves um, with my Kakimori brass pen here. So let's see. So this is day two. What did I see? Cashmere Rose. And sometimes I find diamine inks go like two ways. Either they're looking like a little watery. This one also feels like a little watery, but kind of flowy, but kind of not, but kind of yes. That's a very good explanation, isn't it? It feels quite, actually it does feel like it's going quite nice. Yeah, this is kind of like one of those burgundy wine dusty pinks that are just not my favorite. Um, but I know many people love that color. It's just not my favorite from what I can tell, which is totally okay. I don't need to love all of the colors. So let me see if I can show this a little closer. Let's have it dry a little bit. And then... The last thing I wanted to do is my ink swatch here. I'm gonna, yeah, it's actually, well, yeah. I don't even know, what color is this? <laughs> what is it? It's kind of a brownish pink, burgundy. Yeah, there you go. So let's give this a chance to dry. And then what I was doing is um, actually inking it up and so now I'm trying to think what would actually what pen would I want to use for this um, this is just one of my pouches let me actually close this before I make a mess um, where a lot of my twisties are in it um, so let's see if there's anything that jumps out at me that would work Actually, I'm kind of tempted to use, yeah, I'm going to use one of my platinum preppies. Very boring. Well, not very boring. I actually quite enjoy writing with them, but I have a feeling because it's not my favorite color. Now I need to find the right thing because then I can actually, because I have done this, there's a little O-ring here. So I have 
transfer those into a um, eyedropper. And yeah, that's probably all I'm going to do. It is a the biggest nib size they have. It says 0 0.5. Don't entirely know. And then the problem is if you do turn this into an eyedropper, it won't work for quite a while. So it has to kind of flow through. So then I usually just dip the tip here to kind of make it go. Um, and see how that goes and see if we can get some writing out of this. So let's see. So this is diamine. Yeah, this. OK. Um, cashmere rose. I, want, I worry that. It might just to be too light for my taste, but it looks like it's developing some really nice shading. So diamine. I should really kind of write this down first. Cashmere rose. And so, yeah, so this one, both of these are um, Galen Leather Little Tomoe River 52 gram um, paper. Um, and then what I wanted to show you is how this looks in my Stalagy notebook. So this is yesterday's. And we're going to go to see, oh, okay, December 2nd. So how this feels on the Stalagy paper. So again, it's a really actually quite a nice color. I know many people um, love this one. It's just not, it's not my favorite. Me, Joy. And so again, with the eyedropper, I like eyedroppering my pens, but it does often does take kind of a while to go through. So let me just dip this again. And again, so this is my little preppy. I just thought I might not want to keep this um, ink right now in one of my pens. So that's why I have chosen, chosen, chosen this today. Uh, final recording video. That brought me joy. Um, what also brought me joy is I stayed in bed and read. That has been much, much needed and I loved it. And what else brought me joy? Um, what else brought me joy? That is a very good question. Um, um, my morning coffee. That I loved my morning coffee. And that it's always a little moment of intentionality. But so you see how this, it actually, yeah, it's kind of that dusty pink. Now it's kind of starting to flow. I quite like how it flows. It seems quite nice. And you can see, especially on this swatch, you can really see, wow, the shading. I like shading inks. But um, yeah, so this is the, the shading. We have the bottle, I don't know, the cashmere rose, which is our day two. And then there's the writing on the Stalagy paper. And then our, <laughs> that looks like a, uh, yeah, well, I will get better at this. This looks like a wine stain right now, but you can see the shading. But it's just nothing like, I mean, this first one, I like this one. It's kind of spectacular. This one is like nice, but not like, oh my God, amazing. So we have day one and day two, and that's what I have for my day two.